Hello and welcome back to Massive Chalice of History Lords into the Mad. Now I think we will prevent this territory so we don't sacrifice another one just yet. And we are researching the Ramcat Cave, uh, which is going to be useful, I believe. Alright, we can now take two more heroes with us. Whom do we have right now? We have two alchemists already. But we can get another one. If you want to. But on the other hand, we could do with getting someone from House Vicara getting proper. Like Chike. Yeah. There you go. Chike is now in the party. And then we either can bring an Iron Hand Raven from that specific house. Or another Vicara. Hmm. Or Coxvick. We could bring Coxvick. Let's bring Raven. That sounds like a good idea. Then we'll have uh, Dara, Mural, Raven, Derek, and Chike. Yeah. All representatives of the great houses of our lands. Alright, Chike. We'll check this site first. I don't know how large the map is. Like, we won't cross the bridge. That's what I'm getting at. We're not crossing the bridge just yet. But it doesn't matter, it seems to... connect from over there anyway. Alright, anywhere you can run? <laughs> there, apparently. But in that regard, you could also run just there. Alright. You can wait there. Oh. Enemy spotted. Boom next to him. And turn, and turn, and and turn. So the sea decided not to actually come ahead and attack us right now. Oh, can I hide my troops in the in the thing? Probably, yeah. That might be a really good idea. Hmm. Forty percent less, less, less. Okay, let's go see what you can see from there. More seeds and three bulwarks. Four bulwarks. But never mind then. There's no way we can safely head on in that direction. Okay, where are you? Where can you go? But you can't stealth move anywhere, so... Oh, a bulwark and a cradle. I think I just doomed Raven. I must have, yeah. Get in here. And you, you... Get in there. I'm sure being obscured helps. In one way or another. Ah. Okay, still move over there. That's gonna be the extent of it. For now. Why did they even leave, let Raven go out there? Oh! Well, Raven has rebounds, so. That helped a little. And the pull work did do too much damage. That will do. Oh no, that missed. In that case, maybe if you rush in that direction, we can help the party out. Or I can run away. That could work. Like, make them come to me, we can just uh, set up an ambush somewhere. Hmm. 
those poor works that those are gonna be a problem it's way too many of them you can fall back you and you can't fall back like that right there and there's nowhere you can hide so maybe if we took that down a notch Hmm. <sighs> I could. Let's try that. And then let's try moving in the other units as well. That's a classic blow, which means no stun there. And that's probably a really good chance for an attack for the other guy. Okay. You do your kill. And we'll slowly try to move in the other alchemist as well. Where can you travel? Safely. Okay, let's pretend that's safe. Oh, since when are you a lone wolf? I wasn't aware of that. Gradle, please don't. Oh! So Gradles can actually just make seeds on their own. Without the additional resistance of other things. Okay, well, uh, here's the thing. Are you the. You have precision uh, flasks, yes. Then get precise. And also, when you're at it, kill a seed. The free throw is really useful in that regard. Okay, can we move on? We can. Can we actually kill anything with this without damaging anyone else? Hmm. Hmm. Just throw that flask in. It does help for the next turn. We get the uh, real fun bulwark as well. Okay, and you? Just hit him. Can't stun the bugger anyway. Uh, and you can't reach him just now. Guess the number is not currently available. Ah. And you? You are way too far away to participate right now, so get over there. It's a good thing he's far away because look at the amount of health he has. Not the best. Not the best around. No! Oh, that's a seed. That's fine. Seeds are A-OK -okay in my book. Okay, well, you can melee that guy. You don't need to flask right now. Uh, then we can do some D work on this guy. Yep. With us, the new one, newbie have. First, that's in that regard. Wait. Okay, we'll have to look into that in a turn. Wait, I could have killed that one. Okay, you advance. So you can get a shot on this guy. Good. And then you come back here and kill this guy. It was silly of me to even leave the bugger. So this direction went well enough. So we should have crossed the bridge as the first thing we did. You will make it through this. Sorry, GK. We'll eventually find someone who can actually bring your house to Yana. Because thus far no one has actually been able to level up. Which isn't all that big a deal, but you know. Send them back to that sludge from whence they came. Yes, back to the sludge of you. Okay, that's the dead one and... Can the last one reach here? He can. I wish this was the entire operation, but we still have a dozen bulwarks in this direction. No, I know that's a slight exaggeration, but it's only so slight that may as well be true. Uh, a cradle over there. We'll 
We'll have to find a way to get there safely. That I don't believe will be easy. Okay, let's try and get you moving obscured like. So I don't know how much that actually helps against anything. Well, they did nothing. Right, can you reach him? No. In that case, move closer. And you... You could try stunning the bugger. Let's do just that. Oh, and apparently we also stunned a seed. I was expecting a seed from Oda. Alright, you are Mr. Precision Flask. You can't get close enough. Also, Miss Precision Flask, sorry. Alright, let's move you closer. And this seed won't actually be able to do anything yet. Nor will that. Okay, in that case, let's proceed with the beatdown. You can move over here. It freely dispenses that flask. Very well done. Oh, and level. Nice. So, with your newfound level, we will allow you to carry an extra potion. Just in case. Wait. Does Tara have an explosion? No. Didn't the, was that what I got here? Yes, but I did not fill the slot. Oh, I guess it's a matter of having the ability to carry two different items, but not two identical ones. Alright, well, we'll want to kill this one first, I believe. So let's work on that. Uh, well, I think this is the safer way to do it. Maybe we should have stunned him again. That could have worked. Yes, that would have been wise. We lost the newbie. The newbie of House Tarantino. I don't remember the name of the newbie of House Tarantino. But that's not ideal. Uh, also, once these guys are dead, we will have to heal up our troops here. I could think they all use their flasks. Maybe not Tara, but the rest of them surely need to heal. Yeah, come on, heal up. Because Tara still has the... One additional like, health point remaining from there. Like, we would waste the healing slightly. Yeah. Very slightly, but still, it's, you know. Might be best not to use it up right now. Okay, we can't move Tara just yet, but is there anywhere we can move? Uh, here, maybe? Maybe that's more movement speed for the future? Uh-uh. That's a problem. Oof. Thing is, we're better off dealing as much damage as we can. So we can take uh, out as many of them as we can. Uh, can you... You can. No, sh shell defense is up there, so... Oof. I'll just keep him here for now. Her, even. And then we will try and strike at that one as well. Th which will attract some seeds. As well as another bulwark, I think. I think we might be able to take that. Oh, you're also lone wolf. I wasn't aware. Okay, well, stay there for now. That's a seed attacking. 
And there comes the bulwark attack. Oh, wait, another siege. Does it get close enough there? Luckily. And another bulwark. Who luckily missed? Okay, this guy might have to fall back a little. That's another miss, luckily. And that's a hit. Okay, you come here, kill him. You kill him. Oh, that was a classic blow. Shit. That was part of the plan. Okay, and you run away. Very sneaky like. Like exceptionally sneaky like. Wait, why did he lose health? Oh, now they both did. <laughs> and they got stunned. Good. Can you damage your own troops? No, sadly not. Alright, that was a miss, actually. Just maybe he would have been able. Nope. You fuckers. Ah, okay, we need to get started here. If we walk here and then strike... No, that didn't actually do anything of interest. Okay. Uh, Tara? Can you move over here? And then strike. You can, and it's super effective. Good. In that case, I think we will try and hold out as long as we can. You just wait until this battle is over. Hmm. Whom should I use Star's Potion on? Apparently. That one. I don't remember the names yet. Oh fuck. Well, luckily that was the end of the turn on that guy, bugger, person thing. You can move here. You can strike. And think as you do so. And uh, then we can move in. This heal. This is pretty effective. Okay, and then we can slowly but surely make our way back with this guy as well. I love it when they miss. I'm sure it's perfectly rational for me to love it when they miss, but I love it when they miss. We have still lost two people, even if we are man able to take on this horde of bulwarks. Which I think we might be able to. Sir, can you just do that? You can. Good for you, and you're a madam, actually. Sorry. In that case, can you stun the bugger? Yes, stun that guy. Let's see what happens. It can't blow, that's what happens. Oh, and there's a seed still over there. Which we should look into. Okay, you try stunning that. I think that should be okay. That was okay. Good. And you can kill this now. House Tarantino will be extremely proud of this individual. Ow. But luckily that was the only strike being dealt this turn. 17 to 21. Okay, do it. That was 2. That was not 17 to 21. Okay, well, you don't have to go and kill that. And we will have to hope that nothing else happens. Ah. 
First thing is because of the shell. Can't actually do much with the alchemist right now either. That's what I was expecting. Ooh. That's what I was hoping for, but uh, not expecting, but you know. Completely satisfied with that result. Can you kill him? No, not quite. But the rest of them can. Everyone, punch in one damage. Here we go. You, one damage. And we are... Victorious. I admire your resilience. The people made a hardy ruler. Tara is now level 6, which is excellent. For House Tarantino once said uh, that switching of the hair comes around. Oh! And look! We actually got rid of one of the things over there. It's pretty, pretty nifty. If I may say so myself, and I just did, I believe. Details. Well, Tara, the mess. Uh huh. What is this one? Draw items. Yes, yes, that uh, allows us to use healing items a lot better. Can you have an additional health potion? You can. It was just my incompetence that prevented you. Good. Okay, uh, put it down or rebound? Hmm. Rebound, I think. Yes, that's really good. Yesenia Tarantino, you are only just uh, grown up, I think. Oh, right, we actually did look at that before. Well, Lorelei Tarantino has now died, so the rise of Tara ha is at hand. And that is exactly what we will do. And uh, we'll go with the high fertility option. Yes. And uh, get to making bubbies. Preferably high level bubbies. Quite indeed. That's that was the iron hand. Also good with making bubbies. And that was the we that can't one. decide on what the right move is here. So we require a third party. A single red horse for mute rider has arrived at the capital, which can only mean one thing. The lash is open and accepting applicants. An extraordinarily dangerous and harrowing tournament, the lash is a twelve year commitment with each year consisting of a different trial. Muriel Ironhand asks for permission to make this new suicidal attempt. I believe in you. Muriel, you can do this. You'll be fine. Oh. The current partner has now died. Alright, well, the trick shots are pretty decent actually. Then what else do we have? Well, basically we mostly have trick shots. Well, you can have one of the unheard houses as your partner. So we don't end up with incest later. Yeah. You need to worry about the future. And you still don't have the round caps. Okay, we can defend this territory or this territory. Both of which give us an experience level 4 party member. I think the bulwark would be... Wait, no, the alchemist would be more useful, but this area seems safer because it seeds at gradles and no pull works. But you know, gradles are a lot more dangerous than pull works generally. Hmm. Well, we'll see how it goes. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you then.